Tomorrow, volunteers will break ground on the first Habitat for Humanity home in Redford Township. It's being built for a single mother, and she's been dealing with financial hardships and fierce grief ever since her husband was murdered last fall while trying to be a good Samaritan. Construction on her new home is a beautiful sight for Angela Jackson. I'm in shock. I mean, it's overwhelmed with me. I, I, I just don't know what to think. I'm just getting blessed. Her children are excited, too. They're ready for some good news. The family has been trying to cope over the last nine months with an unthinkable tragedy. Jackson's husband, Anthony, was murdered last October after giving a ride to a woman who flagged him down for help. The woman told authorities she had been beaten. Then her attacker followed her in Anthony's car, rammed the vehicle, then beat Anthony with a tire iron. At one point, I mean, I couldn't even, you know, get up in the morning. I... I had to take months off work to just try to really get my thoughts together. Angela says the loss for her family is still hard to bear. Add to that the financial strain. Her husband had worked two jobs to help support them. I would take that wall down and make your bath, your back room the master. Thankfully, she qualified for a partnership with Habitat for Humanity Western Wayne <laughs> County, which is funding the home through the Neighborhood Stabilization Program. The basement's already been poured. This will be a ranch, 1,200 square feet, three bedroom, one and a half baths, and it will be dedicated on World Habitat Day, October 4th. All of the affiliates was asked to um, provide a significant event that they can highlight for October 4th. And ironically, I thought that Angela Jackson's uh, build would be a great dedication ceremony. It falls in line with the build schedule, and it was just a I didn't know that the following day was the one year anniversary of her husband's death. Just so exciting to see her be able to move past that grief and devastation when she first came in Absolutely. and to see something good happen and to see her smiling and, um, you know, see her move forward in her life. Angela is already putting her sweat equity hours in. Some of her girls are volunteering a bit themselves. It's fun. I like it. It's a new experience. It's something new. I never thought I'd be building on anything. Are you getting to hammer some too? I don't know. <laughs> it might happen. <laughs> there are certainly more smiles these days for Angela Jackson's family as they pick up the pieces and build a new life. You know, there's hope. There's truly hope. Yes, indeed. As you saw in that video, work has already begun on Angela Jackson's home. Habitat for Humanity in western Wayne County will hold an official groundbreaking and wall-raising ceremony at that site tomorrow. It starts Friday at noon.